Professor Charlie Evans here with just a few comments about your assignments for Unit 7 and Unit 9 of the course. The paper assignments in each for each unit I call the, the module essay paper. I'm not really sure if that's the best phrase to use. You could call it topical essay, focused essay, but basically you're writing one to two page papers on a topic that you select in the course. And there's a bunch of different ways that you can select the topic. You can select it on my chronological list, my biography list, uh, broken up by regional geography. The, the, the essay, possible essays are sorted that way. And so you, you pick one of, you look through all of the, the different possible essays you can do, and you choose the topics that you're interested in to write the papers on. The important thing about the papers is that each specific module has a specific essay, essay assignment that you have to address. For example, here's the module on Keith Haring, and you see right there the assignment is How Did Political Activism, Particularly with AIDS and Children's Advocacy, Influence the Art of Keith Haring? And so that's the assignment you need to address in your paper. I don't want a biography of Keith Haring. I don't want anything else that you creatively come up with. I want that specific question answered in your essay. And so each of the module essays available to you have a specific question that you need to answer and that's what you need to focus on. Your intro paragraph has got to provide the thesis points that you're going to explain in your essay that answers the question and so make sure your intro is direct and to the point and focused because if it's not I'm not gonna understand how you're trying to answer the question. So you got about a two-page paper no longer than two pages and you need to use sources you can use any sources that you can find on the, on the web. You can use printed sources, whatever, as long as you cite the sources in your essay. And so each module essay has already a list of recommended web links and books that provide information about the topic. And so that's your starting point, but that doesn't have to be your end point. You can use any sources available to you that you can find. If you have any questions whatsoever when you're working on your essays, be sure to contact me and so that we can get everything cleared up before you submit. Okay, good luck.